started building this track game because God is telling me, say, hey man, you gonna have a platform one day, but you gotta earn your right to be on this platform. You got to train and perfect your game as Dr. Connell West said. It wasn't about me learning track and running track. I had to perfect my game. That was my game, track and field. I had to bring it to the best to the point where I took myself and I took that track and consummated a marriage. I knew everything about my baby girl on that track and my baby girl knew everything about me. So I knew how to lean on that turn. I knew how to raise up. I knew how to caress her. She knew how to caress me. <laughs> I knew how to tell the officials what time I ran before they could tell me what time I ran. So, so when I got to the point where I was raising up, I didn't go to the Olympic Games for medals. Mm. All the medals that I won in high school was for the girls. I, I didn't medal with <laughs> what a medal mean to me? Hey, baby, you like a medal? Here, you got a medal. I'll pin it right on it. Okay? My medal that I won at the Olympic Games didn't mean jack to me, even though they came and told the world they took my medal. Mm -hmm. But I told them, I said, let me tell you something. The medal don't mean nothing to John Carlos. But I earned this medal. You didn't give it to me. You didn't knock on my door and say, we got an open slot. We're going to put you in the team. They said a standard. I meant the standard. That's right. That's I said, this medal don't mean jack to John Carlos. But it might mean everything to my kids. So if you come in to take my medal, bring the militia, because you're going to need them. So they backed away. But when they backed away, they put the propaganda out there for 43 years. If you get out of line, because they train you to go for the carrot, and that's that medal, the carrot. Mm -hmm. If you misbehave and you jump out the circle, we're going to take your medal away. I sat back and I looked at many individuals that was intimidated by that. So now I got the medal, I got all of this, but prior to getting the medal we had, and I'm gonna close it with this. We had an opportunity. I had this opportunity to meet Dr. King. I'd also like to commend the outstanding athletes who have the courage and the kind of determination to make it clear that they will not participate in the 1968 Olympics in Mexico City unless something is done about these terrible problems, these terrible evils and injustices.